everyone, today we're diving into a comparison of six standout Linux distributions. Whether you're just starting your journey into Linux or you're looking to experiment with a new setup, we've got you covered. We'll explore the features, strengths, and some of the considerations for each distribution. Ubuntu, Raspberry Pi Desktop, Fedora, MX Linux, Linux Mint, and Manjaro. Let's get started. Number one, Ubuntu, the gateway to Linux. Ubuntu is often the very first Linux distribution that many users encounter. With its intuitive interface built on GNOME, Ubuntu boasts a modern look and easy navigation. Highlights, a visually appealing design and a vast array of software. Multiple installation methods, whether through the graphical software center or the terminal-driven APT package manager. A few points to note. Canonical Snap packages provide secure, containerized applications. However, some users might prefer traditional package management. For optimal performance, it's best to run Ubuntu on hardware within about four to five generations of the latest machines. Ubuntu makes an excellent starting point for anyone venturing into the Linux ecosystem. Number two, Raspberry Pi Desktop Beyond the Pi. Originally designed for the Raspberry Pi, this distro is built on Debian Bullseye and brings much of the Raspberry Pi OS charm to standard PCs. Highlights, extremely light on resources and capable of breathing new life into older machines. Familiar interface for users who have tinkered with Raspberry Pi, making the transition between devices almost seamless. Considerations, the system may appear a bit dated compared to more modern releases, lacks some of the advanced features found in more cutting edge distributions. Raspberry Pi Desktop is an ideal choice for educators and hobbyists who enjoy a straightforward, lightweight experience. Number three, Fedora, modern and dynamic. Fedora is a favorite for those who appreciate innovation and efficiency in their operating system. With its refined GNOME interface, Fedora gives you a professional feel right out of the box. Highlights, a clean and streamlined look that takes advantage of modern workflow features, such as dynamic workspaces and advanced search functions. A robust software tool and the powerful DNF package manager simplifies software updates and installations. Considerations, Users accustomed to Debian-based systems might face a learning curve with Fedora's package management and organizational approach. The GNOME environment, though sleek, may take some time to get used to for those migrating from other operating systems. Fedora strikes a fine balance between being visually appealing and functionally robust for a wide range of users. Number 4. MX Linux – The Lightweight Contender MX Linux shines when it comes to providing a modern experience on older hardware. It's built on Debian Bookworm and comes with several desktop options like XFCE, KDE, and even a minimalist window manager like Fluxbox. Highlights, designed to work well on both older and newer systems, MX Linux is particularly noted for its low resource impact. Its interface featuring a unique bottom left start menu and accessible system settings gives it an edge in user friendliness. Considerations, since it is based on Debian, some software packages might be slightly dated compared to bleeding edge distributions. The system strikes a balance between stability and modern features without overwhelming the user. MX Linux is a superb option if you're looking to revive aging hardware while still enjoying a fresh, modern desktop. Number five, Linux Mint bridging two worlds. Linux Mint is well known for its ease of use and appeal to those transitioning from Windows. Available in several versions like Cinnamon, Mate, and XFC, Mint caters to varied hardware capabilities and aesthetic preferences. Highlights, the Cinnamon Edition, with its intuitive layout and efficient start menu, offers a polished experience. Mint provides a gentle introduction to Linux while maintaining familiarity for former Windows users. The software manager and underlying APT package system offer a hassle-free way to install and update applications. Considerations, Mint largely relies on Ubuntu's long-term support releases, which means it might not always be at the cutting edge. Users looking for the newest features might need to explore other distributions. Overall, Linux Mint stands out as a reliable and approachable choice for both new and experienced users. Sixth Manjaro, the Arch-based performer Manjaro takes the power and flexibility of Arch Linux and wraps it in an easy-to-use package. It appeals to both newcomers and power users alike. 
Highlights, known for its fast performance, Manjaro is highly optimized for both low-powered devices and high-end systems. The distro offers multiple desktop environments including XFCE, KDE, GNOME, and more specialized options like tiling window managers. Its user-friendly approach allows beginners to tap into the capabilities of an Arch-based system without facing the complexity usually associated with Arch. Considerations Transitioning from other family trees, such as Debian or RPM-based systems, might require adapting to the Pacman package manager. A few quirks in system behavior may present themselves as you get accustomed to the unique structure of Manjaro. For those ready to explore the Arch ecosystem in a controlled manner, Manjaro offers an elegant blend of simplicity and power. Conclusion Each of these Linux distributions brings its own flavor and strengths to the table. Whether you value the time-tested experience of Ubuntu, the educational appeal of Raspberry Pi desktop, the modern dynamism of Fedora, the resource efficiency of MX Linux, the bridging approach of Linux Mint, or the high-performance allure of Manjaro, there's something here for everyone. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out, everybody, and don't forget I'll be posting videos daily without missing any day. So don't forget to like my content, share my content on all social media platforms so we can build a larger Linux community and conquer the world with love. And finally, don't forget to subscribe to my everyday content. Bye, have a wonderful day.